Derek, it's the middle of August 2020 and you're actually looking at a sub 200 gram, in fact 189 gram, let me can read that, um, ASOS helmet. And the title of this subject in today's video is finding a sub 200 gram cycling helmet. So um, the backstory to this is that I do admit that I'm slightly weight obsessed when it comes to cycling and many, many other um, fields of, 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 of life and infrastructure. I am the person that did actually take out the, uh, the seat of my racing Mitsubishi car because it was too heavy, causing immense annoyance to passengers who had to, of course, sit in the back. But back to a more topical point, which is finding a sub 200 gram helmet. So you'd be amazed, but over the years, helmets have just got heavier. And to me, it's unacceptable. Um, I once did have um, a set of neck strain, which was, which was actually caused by wearing not just cycling helmets, but other kind of helmets for prolonged periods. So I'm kind of sensitive to the fact that a heavy helmet does put a strain on your head. Um, and for me, with my weak neck, I really, really always search for a sub 200 gram helmet. But in, in the recent times, it's been almost impossible to find. And I've had this ASOS helmet for, well, it's an ASOS Jingo J1, I believe, helmet. I've had it for a number of years, over five years. And recently I needed a new one. And this is the new one in front of me. However, it suffers from a fatal flaw in which that it is in fact too small for my head. So just to advertise the fact, I'm going to try and put a link if it's still available. This is quite an old helmet. It's not actually made anymore, but I found it from a sort of a, a thrift cycle supplier, which supplies, I guess, uh, stuff that's been out of production. And it's a sub 200 gram helmet. It's just 190 grams, size small. And this version is rather clever because it's got this mechanical, sort of magnetic clasp, which allows you to clip. You can see that. So it just clips in here, and it sort of slides off. I'm doing a very good demonstration. Here we are. Here we are. Slide. It's, it's clipped. So it's a fantastic helmet, <clears throat> and more importantly, it doesn't have this um, slippy protection system inside, which I've never felt as a rider, as a cyclist, feels very convincing. The the SIP, SIP system is a, an inner liner of the helmet that makes the helmet sort of slippy and detached from the actually head. And it basically feels like the helmet's completely loose. Um, it does not inspire confidence, but studies have shown that it could um, help you in an accident and, and reduce your, your, your brain damage. Um, but for me, I think it's a step too far. So I, I do actually prefer having a helmet without the SIPS protection. And I think a lot of manufacturers now have gone away. When it first came out, every, every manufacturer, I remember at um, a Eurobike that year, every helmet manufacturer seemed to be providing these SIPS helmets, but I think um, not anymore. So the story is that this is a helmet which is actually under 200 grams. Um, <clears throat> there's a Lamar helmet which is under 200 grams, but it's, it's kind of very cheaply constructed in my opinion. So I got this helmet. It was an absolute steal. Uh, the, the, the helmet when it was new a couple of years ago was about 200 pounds. This was about 50, 50 or 60 pounds because it's a uh, end of line. And it didn't fit my head. So what new helmet have I got? Well, I've got the new to me helmet. I've got the cask helmet here. Cask Mojito. And how much does this weigh? So let's get the old scales ready. Zero. Obviously I haven't done this yet. I, I believe it's... I, my partner Agata said, oh, it's about 200 grams. She said glibly, let's just see what she was telling me. Oh, 220 grams. 224 grams, in fact. So, uh, <clears throat> yes, not really what I wanted. It's, 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 a, it's a measly 24 grams heavier, but I, I didn't really want that. And it's a size slightly larger, and it fits on my slightly larger head. Again, this doesn't have the, the SIP system. And it has this very irritating strap, which I must do something. It's like a, a leather strap here. Um, both helmets have got this um, sort of clasp mechanism here that allows you to uh, get the helmet snug against your head. 
Uh, and, and apart from that, to me, a helmet is a helmet. And I really, really don't quite understand why people say, oh, this helmet is so much better than, than the other. It's to protect you in a crash. And other than that, to me, it's basically a helmet. So there you have it. We've both got new helmets. Uh, my, my partner's got my preferred ASOS helmet. I can't quite believe it. I've got her old hand-me-down helmet, which was fairly new. Her helmet weighs under 200 grams, and mine's coming at, at a fat boy, 224 grams. Okay, Dari, thanks for watching. I hope you appreciate my grumbling. Bye.